take two. Alright. Good morning. I'm cold and miserable and tired. At half one this morning, two with the Mexican or Spanish. The Mexican. Mexican. Such a racist. Two Mexicans checked in at half one and then proceeded to snore all night, worse than anyone that we've had so far in a dorm. Michael Palin will stand for all this. They're in the shop. Jackson, just carry on. We're here at Zagreb main train station. Say how you will. We're going to Serbia. Oh, you're filming. Yeah. Oh, hey. oh, we're just want a picture here. <laughs> yeah. uh, we're on the platform. Okay. How do you feel about the train journey? I'm excited. Yeah, I'm I can excited. tell. I can tell. Uh, you know, trains and all that. How do you think this experience will be different to our death train experience? Well, I don't know. Maybe we won't return alive this time. I hope so. But, uh, oh, got a bit close. A bit close for comfort. I don't know. I just wanted to sort of uh, prepare you for the danger. Got, have I got a bogey hanging up? Maybe. A bit of gloss in my moustache. <laughs> Anyway, anyway, yeah, good times. I'm not nervous. I'm alright. I'm happy about it. Yeah. I'm glad we're not driving. Look at the snow. Look at that. Yeah. Shocking. Shocking. Uh, there is one slight concern. Someone did say that they might have no fuel in Serbia. So there could be no heating when we get there. It's the Russians. Which, uh, it's the Russians. Stop. Honestly. You have problems. You have problems. Anthony's still very concerned about the communists. It is. Uh, someone needs to help him with it. It's a psychological disorder. They still exist. Stop breathing mist in front of the camera. I'm a communist. We're going to Belgrade. See you in Serbia. It's the other way. Welcome to Serbia. Look at that, plus two, Serbia, you'd have thought it. <laughs> do you ever think two years ago, do you ever think five months ago that would be in Serbia? Well, oh, childhood nightmare, it's not, i making stuff up. Um, That's just offensive. Yeah. <laughs> Probably. Have you actually got anything to say? Probably not. Oh, I just like the camera on me. Oh, you're a pervert, that's right. So, I should probably tell you a little bit of a story, really. It's, uh, it's not Jack and Laurie, but it's... Um, it's dull, that's what it is. So you shouldn't do it in the video. Uh, it's not the first time I've been to Serbia, in honesty. But we you, did, can I ask you, did you think about what you were going to say before you started not this? Not at all. You can tell. Because um, so far you haven't said anything. No, that's true. We. Um, this is all going in the bin, this footage. Down to it, nothing else. <laughs> Went to... Uh, <laughs> We actually crossed the border into Serbia, passport stamped. When we arrived across the border from Hungary, uh, we were informed that the green card for the car would have cost us 250 euros. So we made a very bold decision, but there was no decision to make. We couldn't afford it, so we decided, after an hour of queuing, to go back into Hungary. So and a search. And a search. We got search. We did get search for the first time. First border control, first search. And uh, it was an okay experience. It was worse coming into Croatia, but that's another story. Got searched there as well. We did. Not, 